among women who call the rape crisis center that are actual rape victims, approximately 60% have not reported the rape at the time that they initially contact us. So here we've got a situation, a category of women who could not possibly have been helped by the police. We also find that a tremendous number have not sought any kind of medical treatment at all. And of course, we have several concerns. Uh, first of all, the care of her body is foremost. She has to make sure that she is physically intact. We also are very, very concerned that as many women as can possibly do it report the crime to the police because rapists cannot be caught and successfully prosecuted unless the crime is initially reported. And third, we are also very concerned that her psychological needs are met. So this is a three-prong attack, so, so to speak, that we're working on. And we feel that a rape crisis center is the only organization that can really be concerned about those three things because medical people can be concerned about their aspect, police people can be concerned about their aspect, but we can look at the total picture. What is your name? Mary Westergaard.